Welcome back, my amazing Cancer friends. Um, maybe I should... No, we're, we're going to start with your present energy. See, the camera shut off while I was doing... Or I, as I was getting finished with your, oh, pre your past energy, right? And it's because I have the mouse sitting on the stop button and somehow the mouse on the outside with the cards touched it and turned off the last video. So... Your current energy is the Justice card. So you just you just got out of very toxic bullshit, wow. right? I spun in on the tank as a blue one. And you could even be dealing with a Libra, right? It could be a Libra, a sign. You're dealing... You are the... You're the, you're the Queen of Cups. Okay, you're very nurturing, loving... Willing to do anything and everything for everybody. But this past person comes into your life. You know the one from the past energy that was very toxic? Yeah, they're coming in soon if they haven't already been here. And they're wanting to battle you. I mean, maybe they're battling you through the justice. Or maybe you had to get a restraining order, a protective order against them. Because you just couldn't deal with the bullshit no more. Maybe you're in the middle of a custody battle. Or maybe um, excuse me? a friend came back from the past, not an ex-lover, right? But I'm seeing ex-lover all over the place here. Did you just not see what it did to me? I but your future energy, which is not set in stone, decide, you can decide, uh, you know, the fucking building you can decide I whenever. Falling. Your future energy says that there's, that you, actually, if you really want to think about it, you stepped into this mode here. You were the knight of hazards. All right. What happens is that you've been working your ass off, yeah, constantly like getting what you feet. want, but were you actually getting what you needed out of anything, right? Constantly going, going, going. And it also looks like he ran with his car into um, a pole. Anyway, um, that just means that you were trying to be an entrepreneur. The world's crashing around you. You do the what? But you are trying to come up with a new um, endeavor, new ways. Your doors are bolted. You feel like you're stuck in your head. But ultimately, when you leave this situation and you pull out, you're going to be starting new. Okay? It doesn't feel so like it what now. What the hell? I dropped four feet. It I dropped four freaking feet and died. It does. It doesn't feel like. Now, what is it you're asking again? It might not feel like that this chaos is gonna pass, okay? But it will. It's only temporary chaos, and ultimately, you're gonna be safe in your fallout shelter. You're gonna be an entrepreneur. You're gonna be stuck in your head, though. But that's because you are coming up with new plans and things to do, and also because it's fucking nerve-wracking dealing with a stalker, right? I don't, I don't See, it's crazy, but. Mind. 